Hi guys, welcome to Babylon's Fall, possibly the last mission of the game. We're going to the Helioscope, and we're going to be doing the final mission, I'm presuming, which is going to be the Heart of the Blue Sun. This is the rewards we'll get. There's the infamous enemies, which there is no stats, so there's going to be nothing, I guess. But yeah, possibly the final mission of the game. Really, really sad. Let's go destroy it. Let's do this. We've worked and grinded our butts off, we've crafted, we've done all sorts to get to this point. Now let's do this. Starting with the cutscene. I want to know what this is going to be. Oh boy. Oh god. That's going to be a big box. What the? Mmm, food. Nom nom nom. Okay, that's bright. Whoa. Oh. oh boy. Behold Nagel, bearer of two flames, the sun to forge a new humanity, the pyre to purge the old. My blue sun is the purifying fire of evolution. It shall be extinguished by no man. My beloved children, show me now the depths of your faith. The time is upon us. For ascension. Phenomenon. Back to me so soon. I wonder whether you've noticed. This place, me, all of this, it's never been more than a dream of yours, a fleeting moment. But still, it's these fleeting moments that make up eternity. There's no need for you to suffer. Wouldn't you rather stay here, in this moment, with me? <sighs> no, of course not. Your heart remains unhomed, after all. It'd be a pity for you to give up now. 
Besides, my dear, it seems there are others who need you more than I do. <laughs> so you see, my darling, for now, you must live. It's you. Come okay, we're right into the fight. Let's go. Okay, then. <laughs> Let's do this. Wait, where's my... Where's this? This is my what? Wait, what? I guess this is what my uh, my other Zord does? Oh man, I didn't want this for my weapon. Oh well, I guess we're doing it. Yeah, we'll take it out. She's got a lot of health there. Ooh, she's a feisty one. Doing decent damage to her though, which is good. You cannot resist. Well, you missed. Sorry to say. Uh, did she just heal? Or am I seeing things? Hundred and fifteen damage, hundred and fifteen. And that Zord kinda sucks. Not really a fan of that one. Oof. Needed to come down so I can do some damage to her in the on the ground. Guess I'll just stand next to her and just attack her with my sword. Just have to do it this way, I guess. Embrace destiny. Oh no you don't. Come on. There we go. Got a heal. Oh, no you don't, no you don't, no you don't. No you don't, no you don't. Get closer to her. Oh, she did not like that. Do it again. Is this all she's gonna do there? She must do something as we get closer into the fight there. Now, sing loud the oh, now she's got an axe. That was shield. That's cheating. Ooh, she missed. Ooh. Don't think so. Oh, she got me. She finally got me. Oh, she got me again. Yeah, my Zor's got uh, distance on her, which is good there. He's got some range. Okay, cool. Whoa, okay. Wasn't expecting that. Whew. I 
so wish I had my other Zord. Oh, she about to fall? Nope. Oh yeah. Ooh. Ah, I thought I dodged. It's alright, we got this. Oh, what the? What does the camera just translate like that for? Oh. Oh, I dodged it. Uh oh. Ooh. Now I reveal to you the nature of your end. Ah, oh, no. Duplicating herself. Really? Am I shooting the right one, or does it not matter? Yeah, I guess I was shooting the right one. Huh. Oh. Come on, Shord. Oh, mate. Uh-oh. Uh oh. Alright, let's get closer. Yeah, you better run. I mean, the good thing is I'm shooting the right one. Get my Zor back out. Alright, almost halfway. Where'd she go? Oh, there she is. Oh, that's cheating. Three on one? No, 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 no. That's cheating. That's cheating. There she is. Alright, maybe I should take out her minions. Just so then that way it's not as difficult. Oh, there we go. Alright, that's the real her. Where did the other one go? What the? Ooh! Heal. Let's dodge. Lock onto her. Dodge. Oh! There! Uh oh. Ooh! 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 Getting them dodges. Oh, she gotta do it again? Yes, she is. Yeah, we're actually doing really good considering we can only use one Zord on her. Come on, you got this. You got this. <laughs> I dodged it while she had me surrounded. Amazing. Ooh, 1,300? What? 1,200? What? Oh, is that her charging up or something? Embrace what? destiny. Uh oh, uh oh. <sighs> Too soon. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> ah, walk into it. Ah, uh, minions going again? Really? All right, let's go. I'll take him down. <sighs> oh, come on, let me get out. Let me dodge and all that. Yeah, that's got a lot of damage. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Whoa. Where's the minions go? Not again. No, 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 no. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh, we dodged that attack there. Nice. Come on, quickly. So she's gonna shoot that stuff at me too. Oh, oh another one. Oh god. Embrace destiny. Ah, not again. Really? That's the best you got. Ah. All right, she is gonna bow. I would say like 35% health now. I mean, to be honest, she would probably be be dead by now if I had kept the right sword going. 
Uh oh. She comes with all that junk again. Oh, you can actually just stand in the sky the whole time and just do damage like that? What? Good to know. Oh, jump! Oops. Uh oh. Uh oh. Ah. Come on. Nice. Oh, no, she's not dead. Oh, of course she's gone. Uh oh. Almost got this one. There. Alright, give me another one. Alright, that's a fake one. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Heal up. Embrace ah. Get some damage going. Ah. She's almost dead. Almost got her. Uh oh. Ah. Oh. So close. Ah. Ah. I feel like I'm dodging and just like dodging, dodging, getting attacked, dodging, dodging. Crazy. Ah. Come on then, come get some. Yes. That's what I want you to do. Jump, do some damage. Embrace oh, I was so close. Got it. Now, what was I so worried? <sighs> Done. Mission completed. Oh yeah. Whew, my arm is kidding me from that one. That was the last shooting. See what my combo is. In June, one thinks of weddings, no debts, like a boss. Hey, you got all the bonuses. <laughs> 20,000? Nice. Oh, we got an exotic. Got a few greens. Oh, look at that, 155. Oh, those gauntlets look awesome. <gasps> look at the Zord, got a new one. Ooh. I have to try this out soon. Nothing good. We've lost the machine's sun, and the gravitational field's about to go with it. At this rate, all Neo Babylon will be crushed under Elysium. No, worse. Babylon itself will become a gravity well. A well the whole world's likely to fall into.
It's so weird there's no sand effects when my character does all that stuff. It's just so weird. Like, no screaming, no pain, just silence. Oh, really? I wanted to see that explosion. Oh, there we go. Good. Wait, what? Be damned. Not every day you see a new son born. The light, it's so warm. That's it. Is that all the cutscene? Okay. Salvation of the ruined city. Or should I say of a ruined city. That looks good. Is that his? Is that Isham's? Finally taking his mask off. New quest type available. I think that said siege. Sieges. Sieges are challenging quests that pit you against enemies in a variety of different scenarios. Some will task you with, with defeating waves of adversaries, while others will have you defending valuable imperial equipment or using battlefield gadgets to win the day. 
Compete in CGS awards awards you with sim signatums, which can be used to purchase a variety of rewards at the exchange, uh, including crafting blueprints for extremely powerful items. There are two types of items, each of which can be used for the yeah. Just said that. Uh, Sentinel. Uh, let's see, a Sentinel by completing a siege request for the first time, and by replaying the siege quest you've already completed. Uh, quests are refreshed on a weekly basis. All siege quests are themed after a specific element, meaning that the elements you encounter may have different elemental weaknesses each week. Make sure you equip the right gear for each siege. For each siege will afford you a valuable tactical advantage in these challenging quests. New siege available. New quest up available. Duel. Duels. Duels are grueling quests that pit you against extremely strong enemies called warlords. Sounds pretty cool. Uh, not only will your opponent be overwhelmingly powerful, but you will instantly fail if you go down a certain number of times. Although difficult, doors also offer special rewards to anyone skilled enough to conquer the formidable foes encountered within. Optimizing your gear and formatting, formulating a strategy uh, with your party, with your party, is highly recommended for anyone looking to take on a duel. Oh my God, gauntlets! Good Lord, there's a lot of stuff. Gauntlets. Gauntlets are extremely challenging uh, quests with modifiers that affect various elements of gameplay. Gauntlet modifiers are displayed on the quest selection screen, giving you vital intel on what type of loadout you'll need to survive the trials within. Preserve to the end of a gauntlet and you'll re be rewarded with powerful items and materials that can be used to refine the enhancements on your gear. Coffin voices. Good lord. You've unlocked the ability to change the voice of your Gideon Coffin. Oh, that's cool. Uh, the Ziggurat is full of unknown terrors, so pick a voice that fills you with courage. Achievement unlocked. Liberator. <sighs> that's a lot to read. I want to go check on uh, Isham and see what he's got. Stand proud, Victor the Dragon. Sophia's cleared you to the Imperial Grand Equipment. Imperial Grand? Ho 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 ho! You're staring at me like a sentinel possessed. I'm sure I told you about the equipment class before, no? Ah, well, must have slipped my mind. Long story short, you are now you are now proved to use the same quality weapons and armor that the Empire sees sees fit to issue its own Imperial Knights. Oh? You thought you already were? Ho 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 ho! The average sentinel is strong, but unstable. Giving them a knight grade equipment could be a liability. But you, Sevilla's come to trust you, as she trusts her own knights. It's no small honour. <laughs> if you happen across if you happen across any unusual materials, bring them to me. You would hardly recognise your old weapons and armour by the time I'm done upgrading them. Oh, and you're more more oh and one more thing I've got for you here. Desrian stopped by earlier by searching for you. You might want to pay him a visit when you've got a moment. Oh my god, more stuff to read? I can't remember all this. <sighs> the entrance. The enhanced feature allows you to spend materials to strengthen weapons and armor of legendary or better rarity. Enhancing an item improves its base stats and amplifies the effect of its in innate enhancements. Enhancing your favourite pieces of equipment is a good way to give yourself a tactical edge on the battlefield. Okay, so we don't actually get to see his face either, which is kind of kind of sad. Would have been nice if we did. Alright, let's go talk to this person inside. Oh, this guy? There you are, the mighty fix to the dragon. Your exploits of late are quite the talk of the town. Sounds to me as you're finally a proper sentinel, a force to be reckoned with. Some may say, but listen here, if you're thinking you, you've seen the toughest of what Ziggurat has to offer, well, think again. You've gotten pretty strong, sure, but it's not always about who is stronger, you see. Sometimes it's about, it's about who's faster, other times it's about who has more fitness. That's why it's time, time to teach you about the art of switching attack modes. 
Now listen up and listen good while allowing you a thing or two. Attack modes. I can't remember all this. Good lord. When equipping weapons, you will need to decide which attack mode you wish to see. Each weapon is capable of unleashing a variety of different attacks, which differ depending on the mode selected. Be sure to experiment with the attack modes till you find one which suits your playstyle. Standard mode. A basic attack mode which well suited for stringing together combos. Special spectral attacks executed while using standard mode. Uh, consume relatively relatively little spirit and spirit regenerate quickly oh my god powerful mode <sighs> your spectral attacks can be charged even stronger even longer while using this mode allowing you to deliver devastating hits that deal high amounts of damage attacks unleashed while using power mode drain spirit rather quickly so you'll need to carefully time your blows another one Technical, technical mode. Oh my god. Timing a, a, spe a spectral attack to coincide with the flash with the flash that occurs after certain combo finishes amplifies damage defeat dealt, meaning making this a lethal attack mode for those with an impeccable sense of rhythm. <sighs> a lot of stuff to read. Good lord. Uh, so that's it. Yeah, that's it. What was that trophy, by the way? Complete the heart of the Blue Sun quest. Um, yeah, I do want to look at the trophies, actually. Let's have a look, shall we? We need six trophies, including the Platinum. One, two, three, four, five, and then the Platinum, yep. Alright, so, collect 100 legendary weapons or gear pieces. Oh, good lord. I only have, like, 40-something. Enhance an accessory to level 3. Uh, a piece of armor to 10, a weapon to 10, and that's it. Oh, we just have to collect stuff. Oh, money. Yeah, money's gonna probably be the toughest one. Probably. Okay, um, let's see here. I want to equip the best stuff we just got, which so we're gonna put that on. Change attack mode. Uh, power mode. I don't know, I feel like I should just leave it as it is. I'll just leave it as standard, I guess. I'm presuming I can probably change that when I want. Yeah, I'll leave that Zord on too. Uh, I'll toss that one on. Standard mode is fine. That's still the best helmet. Alright, 149. Can we beat 150 in this video? Can I equip what Divine Armor is equipped? Oh, you can only have one of those gear pieces on at a time? Oh, that sucks. Well, this does give me six. So... There it is. 150. We done it. And there's our accessories. Yeah, level 13 as well, nice. So that's what we look like at the end of the game. Yeah, the gauntlets look awesome. Alright, let's have a look. Progress, achievements. Progression, completed, one of three. Complete all quests in the main story, done. I received the following items. Complete all quests in the Resurrent substory, and another Ziggurat substory. Um, okay. Missions. Daddy's done weekly. Do, 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 do. Okay, orders. Unstoppable. What's this? Defeat Zenon in a duel on hard without anybody going down. Okay. Let's see if we can see there's missions on this board or something. I just want to see. We need 300,000. More points, by the way, to get the uh, million trophy. Good lord. Alright, these will probably be all the side quest stuff. Yeah. There it is. Level 300? What? That's double what I have. Holy moly. Jeez. Oh, there's some down here too? 
160, 200. Jeez. What? Okay, well this should be fun trying to get some of these things done. Oh, I can actually do that difficulty even though I'm way low. That's funny. Um, oh, that's a, oh, that's a skirmish. Huh. Alrighty guys, I'm going to end that there for this video. Thank you as always for watching. Hope you've enjoyed my Babylon's walkthrough gameplay guides. Um, I will do some other quests as well. Like I'll be doing some of the uh, gauntlets, the skirmishes. Some of the other stuff too. Um, just because I want to I carry on platinum in this game. And as you can see, I only need six trophies, one, in, one being the plat, so i got to grind for some bloody time. Don't know how long that will take, but yeah, that's going to be it for this game. Thank you as always for watching. I hope you enjoyed any of this Babylon's content you can find at the end of the video and in the description box below. Um, hopefully one day we get a Babylon's 2, because I did enjoy the story. The combat was nice, um, but yeah, just got to uh, try and get my character leveled up now and all that good stuff. But thanks for watching, guys. See you next time. Wrong button. That button. Where's the bye bye? There it is. No, nope, wrong one. No, nope, wrong one. <laughs> that one. Bye, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Let me know in the comments section what you thought about it below. Check the links in the description and you can pick which platforms to follow me on. If you're new around here, how about subscribing and clicking the notification bell as I put out new videos every single day. I've been Victor the Dragon and I'll speak to you soon.